What's going on YouTube? Um today I'm gonna do a little vlog and something's wrong with my eye. I don't know what's wrong with it. Anyhow, um today I'm doing this morning vlog. Um I'm doing this vlog because there's a lot of stuff that's going on um in the world. There's a lot of stuff that's been said. Um, so, um, I'm, I'm a type of person that, um, I sit back and I watch and I observe, um, what's going on. Um, so, I try to figure out a lot of things because it's a lot of things that's happening. Okay. For once, one thing. Um, you know, this world has been, the government has been trying to find a lot of ways of keeping their eye on everybody. Um, so, you know, they always had said about people, we was going to get the little chip inside of us or the little barcode on us. Um, and you know, every year they change on the way how to obtain how to get information from us in other words um, there's a guy who just put a video up about um, the things that's going on around the world just like I put up the video a couple maybe some weeks ago saying the same thing but not in the same way as he described it in other words we are like I keep saying we are test dummies we are being tested every single day like this coronavirus that's going on they can stop this if they want to they chose not to I, I told y'all about the sensor okay we everybody they want they they they're telling everyone the sensor is a good thing for us because it helps us with schools and funding and all of this different stuff but at the same time this test that sensor is a count a count on how many people should be walking on this earth they think that there are god they are the people they think they think that they can can cut cut us cut us back put us back what I'm trying to say is if we supposed to be uh, I'm just gonna give a little uh, uh, just an example if there's supposed to be a hundred people on this earth and we 300 people on this earth okay some of the people gotta go because there's too many of y'all I can't control 300 people when I don't even want to control 100 people that is the situation we're not getting this concept of what's happening they can cut this coronavirus off at any moment they started this um some time back about it was supposed to be the flu the flu was supposed to be in that same the same thing the flu was supposed to be in this coronavirus. Okay, so they found a way. We have found a way to to stop us from getting too sick from the flu. That's why they always trying to say, well, these doctors, um, some of these doctors are doing this practice when they're not supposed to, and they ain't supposed to be doing this, and they ain't supposed to be doing that. Okay, but then a doctor found a way how to help stop this how, how to help the the flu how to control it okay so now that didn't work okay so now you've thought of um doing other little things now you guys think of this we have the coronavirus going on where people are dying by the millions every day people are getting sick every day 
We have our black young men that being killed by cops. Every two days, three days, four days, five days, one or two people. I mean, just, just think about it. One or two people. The coronavirus is killing us every day. So, the plan is, well, there are, when this coronavirus first started, everybody stayed in the house. Everybody didn't do nothing. Everybody was just... They, sh they shut everything shut down okay then you have this lady they had a um they had a meeting uh with the president and a bunch of other people i can't think of the lady name her what when she stood up the first thing she said was so now since we're all everyone is in their house and they're all shut down when they're starting to get into a violent situation what are you going to do about it she already said that. She said that before this, even before this killing stuff started up again. She brought that up. I mean, she literally brought it up in front of everybody. Nobody paid this attention. She had already just already said, this is what we need to do. She already told everybody. This is what she told everybody that was doing the things that they should not do. She already told them, this is what you need to do. So... The president, I'm, I'm not saying that he, um, I don't know. It's a lot of stuff that he's done and a lot of things that he have not done and a lot of things that he's doing that he should not do. He has been egging on a lot of stuff at the same time as he's been trying to do these little things to, to make it seem like he's not him. So... There's, there's a, uh, uh, <laughs> a, old, a old saying that people have always, older people have said, out of sight is out of mind. So if I start up something different, then they'll forget about the main objective. So if I start up a war or some kind of, uh, violence or whatever, something that's going to cause the whole world to get together so they could forget about the main objective. So, I'm going to start doing something very drastic that I know, I know, I know for a fact if I do this, this is going to fix the problem that we have. This is going to fix our problem. So, you get out there and you cause chaos. Now, you know, coronavirus, if you are about somebody breathing, coughing, or whatever, you're going to get sick. You're going to get this coronavirus. So what is the best way to make the virus spread faster than anything? Start up some mess where everybody's going to be in one place at one time, multiple times. So then you got people who come in from different cities, different places. You're all tight. You're all together. You know, you just like you're in a club. You y'all bumper to bumper, neck to neck. I'm breathing on you. You breathing on me. You coughing on me. You touching me. The virus is spreading just like that. You see what I'm saying? So now, my sensors, I can put a, a pinpoint on how many people I need to finish up or I can stop. You get what I'm saying? This coronavirus, this these people can can fix this coronavirus like this. As soon as the number get to where they need to be, this is going to be fixed. You watch what I tell you. Watch what I tell you. People are not, y'all guys are not paying this attention. If we stay in the house and stay away from this, the coronavirus cannot help. It cannot work. It cannot do its job. Therefore, our numbers will not go away. Our numbers will stay strong. That's why they is complaining so much about um, do, doing your taxes. You can't file these many kids, and you can't file this, and you can't. Think about this, people. Think about this. This is some serious stuff y'all not thinking about. 
Y'all not thinking about this. And I know y'all know just what I'm talking about. Because I know y'all grow up and y'all always hear your parents saying this. I know because my parents have said it. They don't want us to have these many kids because they say they not. We can't file for this. I knew y'all heard this when y'all was growing up. You heard your mom and dad or boy, your mom's boyfriend or whatever talking about y'all can't file y'all on taxes because it's too many y'all in the house. I knew y'all heard that. We grew up with that, so you knew that already. They already was keeping a count, a tab on how many people that's supposed to be walking around on this earth. There is is so many ways that they have tried to fix that problem. That's why they are we cutting off this. And they don't really have to do that. Like um, Social Security and all of this, um, Medicaid and all of this. They don't have to do that. They're just telling y'all that so you guys can stop doing the having the baby things. That's just what they say. They, 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 it's, they, you know, they, they tell y'all stuff. They tell us. I'm not gonna say. I'm gonna stop saying y'all. They're gonna. T they tell us things because they know we take it and run with it. You get what I'm saying? A lot of us sometimes listen to this what they say and say, "Well, I'm gonna do just what they say do." Then a lot of us say, "I'm not gonna do what they tell me to do because I don't think that's right." And the people that's saying that they think that's not right, they do something to them or they do something about it. You y'all guys get what I'm saying? We need to sit back, everybody, sit back and think about of all the things that's happening, why is it happening all of it at one time? It's, 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 you, I mean, it's crazy. How you got the coronavirus and now you got these police people, police killing people. And you know, God doggone well, you have to be at a certain distance. It's, it's, it's beginning to be, I'm holding my, I'm holding this in my hand today because I didn't want to put the stand and everything up. But you, I mean, y'all guys need to understand we are being attacked by a different level of people, a different level. I, I know I, I, I've been trying to figure out why I'm looking at this camera and it got me looking to the side. I don't know. I, I don't know. I don't know. I'm looking directly at it, and I don't know why is it making me look like I'm looking a different way. But, um, but you guys gotta, y'all gotta think, y'all gotta think, y'all gotta think. We we are being tested. We we are these lab rabbits, rabbits, mouse rats. We the lab rats. They are trying to find so many ways of of keeping us controlled. You guys, I put up a video um, some weeks ago about the chemtrail. Um, have you looked outside yet? Go look outside. There is none. There hasn't been none for months. Chemtrails are something that uh, chemically spray into the atmosphere that controls us. It's like a it's almost like the coronavirus. You inhaling this, not knowing that it's harmful, but it's something that eases your mind and can keep you calm. There has not been a chemtrail in months. Go look outside. I, just, I mean, if you look at this video that I'm putting up, that I put up. Go outside and look in the sky. You remember those lines that always you always see in the sky that be all crisscross and everywhere? Think about when the last time you saw one. Think about it. If they wanted to control us, they would have done it. They have not done it because they do not want to. Because if you're being controlled, then you'll stay in the house. You won't let this... Um... Coronavirus and other things take control of you. So now, the best way to make this work is we stop putting the chemtrail up. So now they're agitated. Now we're going to do these killings. So now they're really agitated. Now I can get a million people together in one huddle. Then that'll help kill more people at a time. 
Because if these people get in a huddle, about a thousand of them going to take it home to their family and it's going to work on their family. So it's going to eliminate some of those other people that I can't get to who say they wasn't coming out to this, to the mess that I created. You guys, we are being tested all the way, all the way around. We have to find a way ourselves how to fix this problem because they're not going to fix it because they can and they won't. We are living in a time where we are fixing to be wiped out. They want to start their own creation. That's why they call themselves cloning people. Building parts and stuff. Technology is starting to take over. <laughs> they know for a show, older people ain't going to adapt. So now we get rid of the older people. So now the younger people, we can make them adapt because they like this technology. They like this stuff. So I know they are already there. You, you think about it. That iPhone that everybody is walking around with. Y'all spending eight, nine hundred dollars, a thousand dollars for a cell phone. Seriously, a cell phone. And all you need to do is just talk and text. Come on. They know exactly what to do. So now they're trying to make it seem like everybody in the world have to have an iPhone. I'm not buying one. I'm not buying one. I don't need it. I'm satisfied with my Android. Until the Android stop making them, I'm going to keep buying them. I won't buy an iPhone. I'm sorry. I tried to talk my wife out of one, but everyone got one, so she wanted one. So I went ahead and bought her one. But I'm not buying myself one. Because I do not want one. So, as that been said and said, you guys keep being fooled. Keep being a test rat. A lab rat. Because that's what you are. A lab rat. We are, all of us are lab rats. You want to break out of that cage? Stop doing the things that they trying to make y'all do. For real. Like always, see me on the vlog. We are not for sale. So stop trying to kidnap our people and selling them to these people who is using us as sex dolls. Sex dolls. And making us work in these little places that we shouldn't be. For this little bit of stuff that not paying us and this and that. Y'all things are slipping around. They they I'm talking about it's just all of these things that's happened, they all together. They all is happening for a reason. They need <laughs> doctors need hearts, kidneys. They need these things. People has been waiting for years what's a better way of getting this without waiting on people to die kidnapping you now the markets are getting very very good now because the coronavirus do you know when you die they can do something to your body where you don't have the coronavirus and it can take your kidneys and your lungs or whatever they need and give it to somebody else I bet you don't see on Facebook where, oh, my son, my daughter needs a lung and a kidney. Because now they're getting, I'm, I'm, don't get me wrong. And I don't want nobody to say that I am being an asshole. I'm not. And I understand that everybody needs something. But it's a way of getting this without doing the way they're doing it now. That's what I'm saying. So don't get me wrong because I have a nephew who has a heart problem. And he, they are trying to think about him getting a heart transplant. 
So don't get me wrong. I'm not saying that you don't need this and this and this and that. Yeah, okay. I understand we need these things. But they are getting this stuff now forcibly. Not accidentally. Forcibly. Making us give these parts that we walking around, we healthy. We, You know what I'm saying? You taking another heart from a person that they got a family when there's nothing wrong with them. But they dying because of something that was created by man to make money off of. You get what I'm saying? So don't think that I'm trying to be an asshole. I'm not. I could be one, but I'm not. Because I know everyone has to live. There's something for us on this earth. Not for these people that's taking it from us. So don't don't feel that I'm being wrong. I'm, I, if I have, I apologize. I'm a bigger person. I'm a bigger man. I, 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 if I'm wrong, I'm wrong. But I'm going to end this video because I got things I got to do. Y'all guys see me on the vlog. And again, we are not for sale. You guys, please, six feet. The coronavirus is still taking us out. Please remember that, guys. I got a bunch of new groups. Um, I did get in touch with somebody that we was, we was hooked up at once upon a time. Had some issues. I got that straightened out. Thank you, God. Because of that, I wouldn't have done. Well, I wouldn't have been able to get that took care of. So, I have been able to touch bases with him. Um, I'm going to start putting some stuff up from him. I'm going to go check out a few things that he was working on. Um, I'm not going to say his name right now. But I will shortly. I got a lot of things in line. But because of all of this is happening, everybody that I, in my circle decided to chill for a moment. Because all of us are having the same thoughts. So we're trying to chill with this. Everybody is working on their own little projects on their own until we can figure out a way of getting all of us together. So as this been, I've been saying, I'm ending this vlog for the day. Um, I've been not, I haven't been doing any other videos for anything else. So I'm gonna um, do some bills, some buck, Sasha, and all of that stuff. I'm, I'm gonna do some videos with that. I just haven't done it yet because um, I've been doing some other things. I've been doing some big things. Um, I'll let you guys know about that soon. But anyway, like always, peace.